Many different theories have been put forward to try and explain the demise of the dinosaurs. One theory is that a colossal asteroid hit the Earth centuries ago. The KT event is the name given to the death of the dinosaurs and other species that took place some 65 million years ago. For many years, paleontologists believed this event was caused by climate and geological changes that interrupted the dinosaurs' food supply. The planet chilled and stayed that way for many years. 70% of life on Earth perished. However, the dinosaurs may return. Scientists in Russia, along with South Korea, have been working on bringing back prehistoric creatures to life. The researchers and scientists are currently carrying out research in a lab that costs $5.9 million to build. The Russian scientists hope to study animals that were once extinct from living cells. Finally, they want to be able to move on to restore the creatures. Some of the creatures they are studying include the cave lion and woolly mammoth. This is no longer a fantasy. Scientists from Harvard and Russia have already delved into mixing genes to bring back species that are extinct. They want to put woolly mammoth genes into an Asian elephant and plan to do this by 2020. Some have suggested this could be the start of something huge, with people putting forward the idea that we will eventually have extinct species roaming our planet once again. Jurassic Park has gone down in history as one of the greats. However, there is an important message behind the film. Don't bring back something from the past as it usually has bad consequences. Scientists are also working close with chickens. It's said that chickens are the descendants of the dinosaurs, and the only group that managed to survive the extinction. The idea that birds, including chickens, evolved from dinosaurs isn't something that's new. This theory's been around since the 19th century. This is when scientists found fossils of a bird with the name Archaeopteryx. The bird had feathers and wings, but it had the feathers of a dinosaur, and some fossils found more recently suggest it looked like a chicken. Archaeopteryx came to light in the 1860s, and caused quite a stir in the scientific community. Though the animal had several unbird like features such as teeth, clawed fingers and a long bony tail, some well preserved skeletons were surrounded by a feathery coat. At the time this would change everything, however since this time numerous feathered dinosaurs have been unearthed. Biologists wanted to find out how birds came to have beaks as it's believed they had snouts back in the dinosaur age. The scientists managed to isolate clusters of genes that are related to facial development in birds, and came across a way of stopping them in the chicken embryos. The resulting embryos looked very much like the Velociraptor, one of the most famous dinosaurs to date. So what do you guys make of this, and do you think they should bring back the dinosaurs? Let me know your thoughts in the comments. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more videos.